Hi, John. Thanks for um, spending some time and just going over this little problem I've got about um, tiling and, and setting out. What's your answer to it? Well, I've got a couple of different answers. One is to use, um, if you're using VectorWorks 2010, Which I am. you can use your attribute mapping tool to move the hatch around. Okay. Um, but if you've got an older version of VectorWorks, then, then use the hatch. Um, I use the hatch command off the menu bar. Modify hatch, this one. Yep. And then choose the hatch that you want. Let's put in a, um, a six inch tile. How's that? Is that yep. all right? Six inch? Yeah. Then I can start at the center of the doorway and come out horizontal. And then you can look to see whether you like your hatch. I mean, I personally don't like it because there's a, a little row of cut tiles down the edge here. Too right. That would uh, that would upset me immensely. Um, so let's look at let's look at the other answer, which is to use the because uh, what this does is create a group of lines. So we've still got our polygon. Let's put a hatch inside this and use the new VectorX 2010 options. Uh, so a cross hatch tile. So there it is, and it's still got this problem with the um, the cut joint, the, you know, the, the tiles down here. Yeah. But if you use your attribute mapping tool. You can use your nudge keys and Just nudge the tiles around oh, until that's... you've got. How's that? Yeah, that's so better. So I've got the tiles on the wall here. So that's and a decent cut there. Okay, so it's the tool on the uh, on the basics works group. Okay, yep. Mm -hmm. and so I'm just using my nudge to move the the attribute mapping around. Yeah. Which this these um, not, uh, eight handles over here. Yeah. These eight handles are are actually a, a function of this attribute mapping tool yeah you can um, resize the hatch which I don't want to do oh you can rotate the hatch which is kind of cool I'm trying to look for 45 degrees wherever it is there you go And then just yeah, and then you, you can either click and drag to move it around, or use the nudge tools. And, but I quite like the nudge because you can just nudge it until you're happy with the result. Yeah. Uh, just better put it back to zero, I suppose. It's not set it zero. It looks no, it's just, off, just it? slightly off. Yeah. Mm. No, I get the I get the. Uh, I get the use of the tool. That's an immensely uh, interesting. It's really powerful, and, and yeah. it's, there's nothing uh, it's upsets me more. Things. There's nothing upsets me more than seeing tiling laid out badly, when you've got little slivers of tiles down one side on a wall or a floor. Um, I just like to see it, as much of the tile as possible. I don't mind in a doorway. Yeah. So, so those are my solutions, anyway. Excellent. Nice one. Thanks a lot, John, for that. You're welcome. Have a good evening. Cheers.